wide variety of shapes. The two key words are modern and versatile. Peter Coppola of the Coppola Salon does what he calls a layered update of the gammon look of the 70s. He likes bangs and says a shortcut is easy to maintain. You're able to do a lot of different things with short hair. And it gives the client a, a tremendous option to, to wet it, gel it, you know, blow it straight, with a tremendous amount of texture. Uh, even with curly hair, you're able to cut it and keep the layers very, very long to keep a lot of movement to the hair. It's all very, very soft. There are no straight edges to her cut at all, but very, very long layers. At the John Sahog workshop, John Sahog likes a shortcut, cropped close to the head. It's layered, wispy or jagged to define the face. Frederick Fakai at Bergdorf Goodman says short hair exposes a woman's bone structure. He gives the look a soft, layered edge. Stephen Knoll of the Stephen Knoll Salon likes the look crisp yet loose. He tells me it's not about being slicked back or contrived, it's all about ease. At Salon Ishii, Ishii says a strong color such as red or strawberry blonde makes a shortcut more interesting. He updates the wave cut on model Annie Walker and makes it easy for model Christine Cambea to go from long to short in a matter of minutes. I use razor because I like to create soft edge look for the summer. And that definitely creates a softer look and a more free movement to it because of that takes the happiness out at the same time with the razor cut. You layered the hair right over the head. Not just the legs are layered. Regular layer plus into the hair, another layer to it. That's why hair can move. Ishii finishes the look with scissors to give it a jagged edge. He likes a longer bang. A short bang is a strong look, so you can't change so much, but the longer bang has more movement to it. Annie already has a wave look. What did you do with her hair? I cut with laser again to keep the, make sure it's soft. Lots of lots of layered. So I'm, give a special attention to around her ear to make sure it's framed her face right. She has a certain amount of body in the hair. Yes, that's because of the laser cut plus new technique I use with a scissors and the end that give you a lot of body to uh, give the lift in her end. You also use the gel in Annie's hair. I use a silicone gel, give the her shine and then protect her uh, shaggy end.